hello everyone welcome to my video today in this video we are going to create this model let's start by opening a new part together and step by step build it the first thing that we have to do creating a sketch on the top plane and then later on there we're creating an arc i am clicking arc and here the first one center point arc i'm putting my point in the center and making a arc as you see on the screen after that i will need line and simply i'm connecting these points and then later on from here to there one more point and we convert all this tree into construction geometry and then we will make this one vertical and say this two point according to the, this center line the symmetric while control is pressed in our keyboard now we are going to define our angle 360 divided 26 will be our angle this is the angle of one instances we are going to create 26 copy of that that's the idea outside will be 12.5 radius 12.5 at the end outside diameter will be 25 that's the idea after this point we are going to create a surface extrude surface here under direction we are going to open mid plane option and height is 5 after this operation we are going to create one plane that's why I showed my sketch here reference geometry plane and we pick this line and on top of that point we create a plane and we say OK and now we are going to look normal to this plane and we can hide now our sketch and creating on a new plane a new sketch and after this operation we pick from here a rectangle and now we can hide surface body say from here hide and i'm clicking on my outer edge and say select chain make again everything construction line height is four this uh, length of this line will be 25 multiplied by pi divided by 26 so simply the thing i'm doing here creating a development of that arc and i'm saying okay and program created that length for me and now we are going to create our real uh, elements of sketch all this what we have done was a sportive uh, elements I'm creating here first one uh, line and then I'm taking an arc here I will place again an arc with three point arc also one here first thing uh, what I'm going to do clicking my uh, uh, two object and then while control is pressed on my keyboard giving an equal relationship now we have equal radius and the secondly again a giving a relationship here tangency control is pressed i select two object and tangency and after this point we are going to work on other aspects of defining our elements here i place one line and i do say here ub75 and your radius is one as you see sketch becoming a little bit dark that means we are going to reach somewhere soon a fully defined sketch now we are going to create a, a, a horizontal relationship between this point this two point first thing that i'm clicking my control on keyboard and then making two edge to the point horizontal and then later on creating here one line and defining my angle that's pretty cool 
we are going good. The last thing, adding a spline. We having a spline here and then defining relations of it. Control again pressed. There's two objects selected. Say equal. Uh, tangency, sorry. And then here again, tangency. Now we should define our angle. Uh, tangency magnitude, 2.5. 2.5 you could define this angle here also but i do prefer in this way and then last thing that we are going to do making a mirror we select this line and went mirror and mirror about on this axis uh, sorry this also should be there that's pretty cool and then we are going to create our wrap operation can hide plane. We select our sketch on the features wrap and wrap will be done on the surface. And gave an error. It says cannot be created from intersecting or open contours. That means our contour should be closed. And we will do that. Simply we can create a closed contour. That means an area where uh, fully closed. And we made that. It wasn't a case in the earlier versions of SOLIDWORKS, but uh, something has changed over the years. Yes, this was what we were searching for. And now we are going to do other steps. We go surfaces, real surface, and we select objects here. And we will change direction, will be outwards and two and a half length and everything is fine we can hide this surface because it was a helper for us and now we are going to define thickness which will be the middle section taken both sides and 2.5 and um, 0.25 sorry a little bit bigger nice also yes we have one instances to raise this copy let's first give our uh, fillet here we have a 0.25, a little, little less maybe. Select the edge. It's not giving. Made to, to me also any problem, but I was working with one by one. It's a little stupid. Probably we are missing some things on this connection points. That's the problem, I believe. And then we will go step by step. Everything that we are doing here, even a mistake, in fact, a learning in SOLIDWORKS, I do recommend you as much as possible to things even you found stupid. That's the way to develop this program, the skills on this program. I have learned this program in the times of having no any tutorials in just 2000. I didn't know any English. I was just following pictures and for uh, some photos on the uh, papers, some PDFs. But that developed me a lot of skills that nobody could teach me because I have made a lot of mistake. Here we have a problem seems. Firstly, I'm going to give this radius and later on this one now it work you know yes <laughs> okay this and this maybe and maybe this one now didn't work we are going to change order. Maybe then going to work. Yes. This first. Yeah. <laughs> you see, I didn't do anything interesting, but yeah, I just tried a different way. That was helping. Now we are going to copy it and uh, the point and the top plane. Uh, I'm just going to create an axis now. 
and objects are selected because uh, in advance I select them and now I have it here access and I will change my display state and later on we got circular pattern access selected because it was selected already and the copies and number of instances 26 in fact this is a very nice model could be done very different nice things but uh, for to keep this video uh, short enough for you to not uh, bother you i'm not going to continue combine and i will combine everything add should be selected and we just uh, select everything yes and then then video will be done a little bit calculation time not using a very perfect computer sorry and be with me yes it is done yeah uh, we finalize it thank you for watching if you do search more advanced videos please do visit my channel you will find a lot of challenging videos i'm always trying to create interesting things for you guys if you like my videos also don't forget to support my channel hit the like button and make a comment i will be glad see you in another video